Hi everyone, welcome to my e-commerce Django project. In this video, I want to show you uh, user sign up form and register user from the home page. As you can see, we have a we created a sign up link right here. When we click this function, we access sign up function. We add before previous videos at the previous video. Okay. For sign up, we need the create sign up form. It's Python file forms Python. Under user, <coughs> I created before. Okay. This is not simple form. This is not simple. His name is user creating form. You can check uh, at the Django. Framework user creating creation form. It's about the Django framework. Okay, like this. It is. It is. User creating form, we import this form from the authentication, user authentication, Django authentication uh, library. Okay. <coughs> we need to import this. Import. Import form. It's not Django forms. When the user Okay, for this we need the username, email, first name, last name. It's not about profile. Uh, then you can create, add more information. But for uh, for first uh, sign up form, we need to <coughs> add uh, just login information and very basic information that you can see in authentication user table username is not yes username first name password last name that we can manage in this table all of all of all, the, all others it is managed by authentication we couldn't change and we couldn't and delete something from here. We can just uh, manage something that we can <coughs> we need to add in this area for uh, user authentication. Okay. We have fields username, email, first name, last name, password 1, password 2. Okay. This is sign up form, yes. <coughs> here my sign up, I need to change <coughs> something from here. Before I create it, I just want to, yes, you know this process, you know this, a lot of time we tried same thing, 
check post relation relate form and the form variable and check validation and save information to database okay and right direct to home page if you don't have any post show sign up uh, we need to sign up for okay I want to change save as okay sign up for it's my message I need to just change this for sign up uh, we need to create this sign up form automatically from the systems because it is not about us we just create CSRF token for end of for sign up button and all of other other <coughs> field that about my sign up form is comes from the my uh, my form it comes from here from this from here and from the authentication yes from the auth forms authentications okay I want to check sign up I want to apply we didn't change As you can see, that is our sign up for here. That's come this uh, information is come from the authentication form, is not about as you can see, we don't have any. We don't have any expression it comes it's count help text it is label field help text and errors as you can see here and creates automatically we create automatically from the database okay it's username my name email okay I want to just sign up. I, I write wrong uh, information we got it 
should be doesn't accept my it doesn't accept We need. We may need send uh, user error for validation. If we have any validation problem, else Okay, this form and form we need to send form error. Okay. My son name. I just write wrong name. Okay, we got errors. Password two two password field done didn't match. As you can see, we sent with the error. We have same code up to sign up form, and uh, here for that we got two place message. Okay. So you can manage, you can see your errors, form errors, and you can send with the message. Oh my god, password field didn't match. Okay. I want to explain for you something. Uh, after save, this is signed, it's completed sign up here. This code is about to automatically login again to the systems. It's the same thing as you can see at the login. This is the same. After sign up, uh, 
for for user uh, we we create automatically uh, log into to the systems with that with this code username password and send authentication and login process uh, I want to enter right information yes Okay. I want to access as you can see. I have login in the systems, but this user doesn't have permission that for access to admin panel. For that I need the login again. Not with admin. Okay, as you can see, user, if you want to give permission to access admin panel, you can give stuff permission, like here, and you can change permission, it's up to you, this is just user. Okay. In my account, uh, the next video I want to show you uh, create user panel and manage account and uh, add profile user profile information. Manage user in profile information in this area. But in this video, everything about the sign up user and automatically uh, login the systems is like this process. Okay, thank you for watching. See you next video.